is a process where a caterpillar becomes a beautiful butterfly, and it's a lot of fun. So there's some science behind it, too, so that's why we have our kitchen pantry scientist, Liz Heineke, here with us. Good morning. Nice to see you guys. This is so much fun in your backyard. You've got all of this kind of magic going on. Yeah, and this is better than any toy you can buy. This is the most miraculous transformation your kids will ever see. So while they're out hunting for Pokemon, yep. I would suggest... Which they are. You, th yeah, they will be. Tell them to look for some monarch eggs yep. um, and monarch caterpillars. Now, I'm incubating eggs on M M Pokemon Go, but you're yeah. saying <laughs> we can watch real eggs and incubate as well. And they're alive and yes. they will fly off into the sunset. Yeah, so monarch caterpillars only lay eggs on milkweed. And there are several oh. kinds of milkweed you can find. You'll see it in the ditches. People are planting it in gardens because everyone's trying to help the monarch survive, right? Yeah. You guys heard about that? Absolutely. Yeah. They've so, lost their habitat. So, so it's this stuff right this here, This is right? common milkweed. I don't know if you can see this. It has these sort of broad leaves. Okay. And tell your kids to look on the bottom of the leaves. And it may be hard to find them, but I was out looking last night. I found tons of eggs. Oh, wow. They're tiny white, um, about a little bigger than, like the size yeah. of a pencil lead. So they you can find them on like the bottom of... They almost look like a little of, speck of dust, but there they are. They right? almost do. You don't yeah. need a magnifying glass, but I it's do. Modified. It's kind of fun. Yes. That it way is kind though. of fun. <laughs> There's also swamp milkweed, which you can find going around. It has these purple flowers, and you can find this at a lot of cabins. Mm. Monarchs love this. And then common butterfly weed. But monarchs only lay their eggs on swamp milkweed, or on milkweed. milkweed. So right. find eggs. Get a glass or something, poke a hole through some aluminum foil, and put your milkweed in the glass. Your caterpillars, wow. as they grow, will need plenty to eat because they basically, a good analogy, they, when they hatch, they're, you could compare them to like the size of an eight pound baby, and in two weeks, eating only milkweed, they Weed, they grow to the size of a garbage truck. Oh, wow. And so, show us them. Then it takes a step. You put them under a heat lamp? Nope, that is no. not a heat lamp. That's an old it's, aquarium I found oh, in my basement. Oh, it's just an aquarium. All right. Put screen over the top. So you're protecting it? Yep. Keep giving them fresh milkweed. They'll eat the milkweed. They will lay there lots of times on the screen. They will form, they will transform into a chrysalis. Look at that. Yes, this is their pupil stage. Wow. And when they're in this chrysalis, they're actually undergoing cellular changes. Mm -hmm. Their body parts are shifting around. And they will, it will get darker and darker. They'll hatch as a butterfly. Cool. It's, a, it's cool. really miraculous. Liz, thank you. Totally recommend you it. You can learn more about this at kitchenpantryscientist.com. We'll get you there at wccocom links. Thanks, Liz.